Hey Lego fans, Maxine here once again. Welcome back to the channel. So today is a very exciting day because I am waiting on some deliveries coming. So some deliveries have already arrived from Amazon yesterday and the day before. So they are currently under the desk there. So they are all to do with what I'm waiting for. It's not Lego, but it's Lego related. And I'm super, super excited for this, like beyond excited. I think even Aaron's maybe somewhat slightly more excited than me and I'm really excited so I can't wait to share with you guys what is coming it is something that I did not think I would ever be purchasing um it just has blown my mind that Aaron has managed to convince me to buy this stuff the other thing to note is that little girl baby girl is not with me today she is with her grandparents so I have the entire day to do lego content and uh yes yeah, so it's like I don't know, half nine today on a Wednesday. So I have the rest of the day to be doing Lego content. I've already done all the chores, the washing, the cleaning. I had to get all that done first, otherwise it was gonna annoy me to hell. Waiting for this delivery coming in. So in the meantime, I'm going to have a pastry and a coffee because I'm gonna need the energy. I'm gonna do loads of content today and uh, stagger it out for the rest of the couple next couple of weeks, which is super exciting. Um, and yes, just wait for this delivery. I really hope it comes soon. I know it's like at the local depot, but it's not out yet. Okay, so I've now since had an update that the parcel is en route. It is with the courier, courier, delivery person. So it should be here imminently. And conveniently, Aaron is also on his way home from work. So I don't know if that's, uh, you know, there's any kind of reason in, in for that. I think he just wants to intercept my parcel and steal it from me, but it's all very exciting. I'm so excited. Of course, it's when I'm eating my lunch that the delivery arrives. And Aaron is home now as well, so he can help me up the stair with it because I think this delivery is going to be a bit heavy. <laughs> is it heavy? I'm not lifting this. This is yours. Because you went downstairs and I didn't stop you. Woo! Box number two. How many boxes is there? Three. Three big boxes. I wonder what this one is. Oh. <laughs> Maxine, where are you? Ta da! Look at all the boxes! Well, no guesses as to what this is. <laughs> it's pretty obvious now. Oh my goodness, there's so much to open and so much to build. Luckily, I have a boyfriend who knows how to build all this stuff because I wouldn't know where to start. So let's start opening boxes. So yes, from all the boxes, you've probably worked out that we are building me a computer. And it's like a gaming computer. So it is like the actual, the full blown raw, like crazy shenanigans that I've been drawn into from that guy through there. So yeah, let's have a look at what is in all the boxes. It's like Christmas. It feels like Christmas. So What's in that one? The small one. So this is my new mouse. Okay. Ooh. All right. So in this Amazon one we have... There's actually still another Amazon one to come today. <gasps> oh, I'm so excited about it. This is my headset. Proper gamer chick right here. Aww. This is so awesome. I love this. From Amazon. So this one is... Oh. oh, my keyboard! Oh, Aww. very matchy it match. Lights up, it's matchy matchy, matchy matchy. So yeah, this looks fantastic. Now, I think we're gonna get to stuff. Now we're gonna get to stuff that I don't really know what it is. Well, this one. Oh, sure, I've hit record by the way. Ah. Oh. You're still planning. Leap. So this one is obviously um the monitor. Let's so, leave that in the box right now. We'll just leave that in the box right now. But let's open these ones that have been taped. Oh my god. Hopefully you didn't cut any wires there. Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there's a few things in here packed all together. Okay, you tell me what things are. Okay. <laughs> so first we have Oh, an SSD, right, okay, so this is the thing that like I don't know, makes it go <laughs> no, it's like memory. Yeah. It's like hard drive memory. Yeah, we'll sort of that. thing. Meh, meh, meh. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, there is something in here. Heat sink. Okay. Says what it is on the box, pretty much. This is a Vengeance RGB Pro SL. 
I don't know what it is, but the box looks quite nice. Um, oh my god, I can't even get these. Okay, so this is a fan, set of fans? Mm, not quite. Sort of, like, thing? Filter? Mm -hmm. No. Thing. You called them fans when we were shopping. No, right? that's that's the graphics card. But it has a big picture of fans on it. Yeah, because graphics cards have fans. Whatever. That's just confusing. <laughs> <laughs> so this is not a Scooby. This <laughs> is. <laughs> it says B five five zero gaming plus AMD. Oh, it's a motherboard. Yes. Since it's such small writing. <laughs> Right, okay. The motherboard. Motherboard sounds so like. Um, a processor? Because, you know, things need to be processed. Uh, maybe don't precariously. That's very That's... expensive, that one, so don't. Okay. Let's not have that. Meh, meh, meh. Oh, I'm so excited for this one! <gasps> this is the Stream Deck. So we saw this in Curry's PC World, and I think I knew about it like. Ages and ages ago, and then I forgot about it, and then we saw it, and I was like, I must have this. So, this is probably right up there with like what I'm most excited about. <sighs> okay. Um, and then we have another SSD. I didn't realize we were getting more than one. But okay. Well, this is heavy, so this is the power supply. This is the big, ugly black box that has to go in it. It'll be hidden though, in the case. Yeah, it'll be hidden, so it's fine. And this one looks colourful. Oh, then you got a rainbow. <laughs> I just hurt my throat when I did that. So this is the liquid cooling fanamajig. <laughs> but this looks so cool. Look at all the colours. Okay. So now I know what's in these ones. So this is, as I already said, the monitor. And this is the case. Pretty, yeah. pretty case. Now the case, Aaron is now very jealous about it because he wants one like it. So, he's not getting it. <laughs> this is my case! <laughs> my case! But we will now uh, crack on and open up the bigger stuff. Oh, taps off, taps off. It's obviously getting uh, ready for the, the sweat that's going to be involved in building this, apparently. Is it going to be a workout for you? Yep. <laughs> <Stressful>. <laughs> that's why I'm not getting involved. And we have the case out. It looks so pretty. It looks like just like a big kind of white fish tank at the moment, but uh, it does look like it's gonna be nice and sleek and very, very cool. So we've got a modular power supply, so we don't need to have excess cables in. My PC has a non-modular one and it's a pain in the arse. <laughs> so this is going to get mounted in the back of the case. So. When the windows are on, you won't even be able to see this black box because it's going to sit here. And then the motherboard is going to cover this gap so this won't be visible at all. Mm. Um, which is nice. So it's a big ugly black box that you're not going to see. Yay! No <laughs> big ugly black black. That's really hard to say. No <laughs> big, big ugly black box to be seen. <laughs> so it can only be put in one way in here. So if we look, the four screws here, the holes. They match the four here, so that if it went this way around, the screws wouldn't oh. line up. So we know this has to go in this way, which also makes sense because the fan's pointing at the back. Sure thing. <laughs> <laughs> now trying to work out the next step. So is that the... That's the power supply. The power supply is in. Yeah. Boom. Pass me the motherboard. The motherboard. Okay, so we plug the power supply in, even though it's not connected to anything, what this allows us to do is ground ourselves, which is very important when handling PC parts which uh, can be damaged by static electricity. So by having this power supply in and on, when I touch it with two hands, I ground myself through the ground cable. Okay, dokie! <laughs> Physics! <laughs> So Aaron's just done the typical guy thing and thrown this at me and said, We don't need this. Oh, we don't. Man, no need instruction. Oh, Man, okay. do build with no instruction. Man, Where no need help. <laughs> right. These are anti static bags. Bags, conductive grid bags, they're called. So they prevent static affecting the components. And there we go. The motherboard. Oh my god. That looks. Pretty cool. 
It's got LED lights in this bit as well, which we'll see later. Ooh, this I'm is excited. Where we're plugging everything into. Okay, so it's important. It holds everything. <laughs> it's very important. Without this, is the this is like oh, I don't know it's, the brain. It's not the brain, no, because the brain. Oh, the, we were thinking the same thing the, though. The brain's the process. <laughs> the processor. This is kind of like the body. So okay. This is like the central body, and then the legs and the arms, and the brain gets plugged into the body. If that makes sense. Okay. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to do the most important and hardest probably most stressful bit that I don't like doing is putting in the processor. Yeah, we're gonna do that next. Because we may as well just get over and done with and then everything else is easy but I don't like to put processors in. We used to have pins but I'm not too sure. We still do have pins. If you bend one of them you fuck the whole thing up. So <laughs> let's see if it goes alright. <laughs> processor time. That's the processor. Oh. So here we go. So this is the part where I need to be very, very quiet. It's very hard though. <laughs> With the processor, there's a very, very small arrow in one of the corners. Mm -hmm. And this matches up with the very small arrow on the motherboard in this corner. So these two arrows match up and it'll fit. It will not fit any other way very well. So you need to match the arrows together. This lever comes over, and that allows the processor to go in. Okay. Da -da -da -da. Done. Wait, why was that so hard? Well, it just feels it just feels a bit harder than what it is. I had to line up a thousand pins there. I was just very good at it. <laughs> <laughs> And that's it. In. Okay, so all those dramatics. I'm trying to say girls are dramatic. <laughs> More instructions for you. Ow! <laughs> that's the NVMe storage in. That's quite simple. It just goes in this part here. You remove the two screws, slots in, down, we screw on it, remove the film from the back side of the heat sink. Fish bash bosh! Fish bash bosh. Easy part. Mm -hmm. Can you pass me the RAM? The RAM! Yeah. Uh, this is one, this is one, this is two, this is two. So you put your first two in here, first two in here, and you always want to make sure your two sets, uh, if you're putting in two sticks of RAM, the two match each other. So these two should be the same, and these two should be the same, but these two could be slightly different from these two. And the RAM we've got has got nice LEDs along the top of it as well. Woohoo! It's going to be lighty lighty. <laughs> Lots of lights. <laughs> We're going to put this, the motherboard, into the case now. Best doing this before we stick in graphics cards or anything like this uh, because the graphics card can cover up holes and just makes it a little bit heavier. Uh, so this is all going into there now. Ooh. So don't put, try and put it in like this because that will be really difficult. So you put this on its side. Mm -hmm. And then now I can just pick it up. Put it down. Hopefully it fits. <laughs> Motherboard's in. Motherboard's in, cool. SSD's in. SSD's in. Um, yeah, cables and stuff now. Oh. You feeling good? Yeah, we've got to figure out where all these go, and then we've got to figure out how to power everything, and then, yeah, figure out where the screw that I've randomly found those like <laughs> fell out. I'm putting too much faith in you with this. You're gonna like it. And that was just one of the screws there. That's done. Uh, and then we have to install LED lights. Okay, that's the exciting part. I don't know where this one goes, but. Uh, well, maybe it's in that instruction booklet you threw. I don't remember any instruction booklets. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so as Aaron is doing this stuff, I have started to unbox the monitor. So this is the monitor here and all the bits and pieces for it. So all the cables and the stand. And also, Another Amazon delivery came. So this is the very, very last one. So I know what this is. This is a mouse mat. So I'm going to be opening that up just now as well. So we've hit a snag a little bit with the monitor in that it is very tall, but it's not going to fit under the shelf. It is literally like a centimeter too much and I can't get it to go any lower. So we are left with the option of one, 
getting a mount for the wall and then mounting it that way so it's like nice and snug underneath but even then I think it'll be quite snug the only other option is to take the shelf off and move it up slightly so that's a job in itself <laughs> so we are now considering option three which is swap monitors so Aaron already has a very very wide curved monitor over there and obviously I have this one so it's a potential idea because he likes to game a lot and this is like a better PC f well monitor for gaming because it has a faster refresh rate. refresh rate apparently and apparently I don't need that but he does so he could be telling me all sorts of poop and I would have to believe it because I wouldn't know but that is a plausible option because then it means there's no DIY involved at all we would just have to swap them around and where are we at now with the PC? Connecting fiddly wires. Connecting fiddly wires. Apparently a lot of these wires though are LED lights. So it's going to light up like a Christmas tree. It's going to be so sparkly and so colourful. I'm so excited. Right, what's interesting? You just made a funny noise. This is magnetic. Magnetic? Ah. Oh. That's it. That's LED lights. There. Since your case is metal, we can slap, that slap on. these on wherever. Yeah. Okay, so we're about to plug it in. And it's all not been asterisk, it's just test mode leaving everything This is open. test mode. Oh yeah, the, this monitor's staying here now. We're going to have to move the shelf. We've established this now, but yes. Shall right. I press the on button? Yeah, go for it. Ooh, this could be very anticlimactic in a second. <gasps> Nothing <Yeah>. happened. <laughs> okay, so. So. We had put the power switch into the hard drive lights so down here. So these oh. these super super fiddly little connections. Oh, so uh, it's it's the computer's fault. Yeah, for being fiddly. Okay, uh, so we're gonna try it again. Whoa! Oh my god! <laughs> that is insane. It's like a disco going on in the computer. That's friggin' awesome. Aww. It just looks so good with the white as well, like... So this... Ah. Just checking... Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. if the monitor will come to life. So cool. You never think a computer could look so like, I don't know, jazzy and just fun. So we finally managed to get it working. Yeah. All the lights are now on. Every single one, there's so many. Looks so pretty. And we managed to get the monitor working because the display wasn't working to begin with. But all I had to do was install Windows on this monitor and then plug it back into this one for watch. some reason. Yeah. yeah. Computers yeah. are just, yeah. Have minds of their own. But yeah, coming together now. Okay, so it is now, what time is it? 10 o'clock? 10 p.m. Uh, we've been at this since. 3 ish. 3 ish. And we're still going. It's done. But we're, uh, yeah, we're, we're getting there. No, we're, we're still doing the software, like installations and stuff, yeah. but it is looking pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. Thank you, the lights have gone off because I've just restarted it. Oh, there they go. Come back yeah. on. So it's looking pretty sweet. My own little gaming station. I'm calling it a gaming station. It won't really be used for gaming. Probably. I'll probably be coaxed into some stuff. But ultimately this is to make a better streaming uh, experience. So yes, yeah, very, very exciting. Very colourful. Like you can tell this is, well... I can't say you can tell this is a girl's, like, station, but, like, <laughs> it's mine! <laughs> okay, so it is now Friday and everything is complete! So I'm so excited to show you all the full setup. So here it is! Da, 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 da. There we go! The full setup for all of my LEGO streaming. Obviously I had to put the YouTube channel on because, you know, gotta plug myself, so... <laughs> There it all is, so the computer is all set up, my headphones are on and charged, and my mouse and keyboard which lights up, which is so cool. 
um, and this is like just like a little rest for you know when you're typing and stuff and yes you can see that the monitor is now pushed back to the wall so it all fits really really nice uh, Aaron managed to do some DIY when I was out earlier with baby and moved the shelf up so all the Lego sets that were here before are now in storage because I've also decided I want to change up my display as well since it'll be right above my streaming station so I want it to be perfect and yeah so this is just my like uh, light that I always have just for like streaming and stuff and our camera mount as well for different camera angles and you'll notice as well that the stream deck is still in the box I will be unboxing the stream deck off camera and just enjoy myself with that uh, can't really be bothered filming about that to be honest I just want to enjoy it so that is it that was an interesting experience but uh, I think it is a success and I just love this Ah, it's awesome. So obviously we have to speak to Aaron who put this <laughs> lovely piece of art together. Are oh, you are you oh, happy? Uh, yes, I'm happy because I get to do this. Oh, okay, I'll let you do it then. Oh, ah. You've not even taken this off your own PC. Oh. <laughs> oh. And that's it. It is official. Open for, it's open for now. <laughs> it's like a, what's it called? A red ribbon. I should have gotten a bunch of Lego bricks just to chuck on it with <gasps> confetti. No, because then I would have scratched it. Yeah, no, don't touch with your fingers. No, I'm not. Yeah. But this actually, like, it doesn't maybe show on camera so much, but it, oh my god, it looks so much better. It looks like it, you could actually put your hand through it. It looks so clean. Yeah, so, clean. we'll see how long it lasts. So that is it from us. Thank you for coming and watching this video. It was totally different from all the other content I've been doing, but I just really wanted to share this experience with you all about us building me a computer. So this, as I said before, will all be to improve the streaming experience that I'll be doing, just making it more exciting for me to sit down and do all this stuff. So I am so, so excited to be making more content with my new setup. And yes, obviously come along to one of my live streams that I'll be scheduling to uh, see what maybe new features pop up from my stream deck. All very exciting. But that's it from me. Please like the video and subscribe as well. And yeah, stay tuned for more absolutely awesome LEGO fun content. Bye!